Good afternoon guys, we uh, are in the southern three state uh, in a, on a farm near Betuli. The farm's name is MS Ziplink. Uh, I've been hunting here since 2013 and it's uh, a great place to hunt, a uh, plains game. And this weekend we're here with the Wildman team and the Wildman non-profit organization and we'll be hunting uh, meat for charity and we support old age homes and children's homes and we uh, give them the meat so um, we had a, a very successful raffle last year and this is the culmination of that uh, we're giving away a Musgrave M21 uh, 375 H&H &H this year in the raffle and one of the prizes is uh, for a lucky uh, draw um, somebody that is buying a ticket will be uh, maybe two people uh, will be joining our hunt next year uh, we're very busy off loading um, and I'll show you a little bit more about the farm but uh, here are the two champions wild man um, priorities like you can see there sorting out the drinks dehydration is definitely one of the things that you want to avoid on a hunt uh, so Marku is attending to that for us and this is Tini one of the owners of Wildman George. Uh, Tini, is there something you want to tell us about this weekend? What's the expectation going to be? Uh, we are very excited. We are very excited. For all, we are going to have a for the kids, for the old people. So that we can make all the blouses a difference in the community. And then uh, the other owner of uh, Wildman in George, Marco, like you can see, we've just offloaded the two-ton meat trailer. <laughs> yeah. I'll post the photo in the video, <laughs> but <laughs> yeah, we, we kind of, uh, um, yeah, <laughs> we're, we're very hot. Marco, uh, what's your expectation for this weekend? Yeah, we're going to get a little bit of fleece. So as my dad said, there are people who are hungry, so George is going to get a little bit of yeah, so uh, this weekend we'll be hunting this farm for Plains Game, uh, white-tailed white new or uh, swart wildebeest as we call them, uh, maybe some blessbok, uh, springbok, warthog, things like that. Um, yeah, and like I said, the, the meat is going uh, for a very uh, charitable uh, um Reason. So yeah, I've, I'm, I'm very hopeful that we'll get our quota this weekend. We should. The form is always delivered. Um, you'll meet Briggs uh, or Ritger a um, little later on. It's his parents' farm and we'll be hunting this area. Um, on the way here, uh, we uh, pulled a, a two-ton trailer that was uh, sponsored to us. And I'll post the link to the sponsor where you can contact them in the description. Uh, <laughs> Uh, it's a two-ton meat trailer um, and if you want to rent this trailer there is the number uh, if you're in the garden root area or hunting in that area uh, please feel free to contact these guys uh, they sponsored this trailer for us uh, on the way here <laughs> we traveled in my Pajero um, <clears throat> it's a v6 petrol and uh, we calculated uh, about 3.8 kilometers per liter so my, my budget for petrol uh, just went out of the, the window there um, remember guys this is a charitable hunt so uh, although the meat is sponsored uh, everything else the costs of getting here um, the accommodation uh, everything else uh, comes out of our pockets and uh, we're proud to do it because we know that it's going for a, a very worthy uh, uh, cause um, and uh, in the, in some of my next videos, I'll I'll show you uh, where the meat uh, gets delivered to some of the places where we try and make a difference. And uh, obviously, we're looking always looking for new ways to make a, a difference and and to make it not only meaningful but sustainable. Um, so, if there's any one of you guys that want to to uh, uh, come and join our cause, uh, the Wildman NPO nonprofit organization. Um, please do so uh, if you want to donate 
uh, any meat, if you're in the area, uh, please contact uh, Tini. I'll give you his number in the description of the video. And uh, if you're anywhere else, um, we our partner is Solidarity's uh, Helping Hand. Um, th that's our charitable partner in this, and they help us with identifying in, uh, the, the causes and uh, distributing it there. So um, I'll uh, introduce you guys to Marlies from Helping Hand. Um, yeah, and, and I mean, if you want to make some donations, uh, we're always open for that. If it's meat that you've hunted or if, if there's meat and you want to make some space in your freezer and you want to donate it, please, guys, um, you can do that. Uh, instead of throwing meat away or it going off, um, you can always donate that. So I'll, I'll uh, put a link to Helping Hand in the comments and you can contact them. And uh, if you're not in the Garden Route area in the Western Cape, you can definitely contact them and they will... Uh, get you in contact with a butcher or a place uh, where you can take the meat uh, for further distribution. So, yeah, um, the weapons that we'll be hunting with, uh, the 270 Winchester, uh, you would have seen the reviews of the next level silencer that I did. So I'll be using that, uh, using 150 grain PPU bullets. Uh, we're going to the range now to zero uh, quickly and then tonight we're going out uh, for the first hunt, it's a three day hunt, so we need to finish up by Friday and Saturday we're doing the trek back. Um, some of the other rifles here, 306, 300 Winchester short magnum, um, but I'll, and yeah, uh, 6mm SLR. Um, I'll introduce you to the parties and uh, a little later on and make them tell you their story. And uh, yeah, uh, like I said, uh, welcome and enjoy the hunt with us. Tini shooting his 300 WSM for the first time ever and uh, he's going to go hunt with it now some would call that a gamble but uh, Tini is a lucky guy because it's a musgrave last day of the hunt and uh, we filled our quota for meat yesterday so today, just going out to see if we can't find some shallow peaks, Vlakvarke, or Wodok, as most people know them. And uh, yeah, let's see what we can do. Marku, what is your expectation for today? Tini, do you hear today? I think you can see that the is very relaxed. Groot expectaties for the day, not behalve om te geniet. Dat is al. Je moet net een beetje groter verwachten dan als gisteren. Al gisteren deed dat dan al die verwachtingen. Niet niet klein niet klein verwachten en niet groot verwachten. Ja, is het gisteren goed gedaan? Ik wil ons het zeven zwart willen beesten in chemisch ach blazebok, zo drie blazebok, zeven. Zwart willen beesten, dat is wat ons wil gedoen het. Ja, en twee varkies. En twee varkies, ja. Ja, ja, zo. Goeie dag gister. Ja, wonderlijk. Een dag relaxed. Wil je zo iets sê vir ons oor die maaskruif weggeen hierdie jaar? As jy nou iets vir die ouwens kan sê daar by die huis, wat sal het wees? Ja, hierdie was, hierdie jacht het, is die Fondse wat ons laas jaar geën het met ons raffel, het ons hierdie geld ingesamel om hierdie bokke te skiet. Ons het die aard sien saak ons eie petrol betaal om hier te kom wat baie dier is. Ons het dit nie in die raffel het gehaal nie, ons het betaal ons eie verblijf, eie kos en 100% van die geld wat ons ingesamel het gaan vir die wild wat ons geskiet het tegen een baie afslag prijs hierso. So ons is baie blij om een groot lomp vlees, elk so onder 1 ton, tussen 750 kilogram terug te vat George toe. 
en hoofdzakelijk daar aan, aan oude thuise wat nie staat sal kry nie, te voorzien. Ons het dit al gedoen en die dankbaarheid wat ons daar uitkry is, is fenomenaal. Dit maak alles die moeite werd. As sê, daar het jylle het uit die perkse bek, so te sê, en uh, ondersteun asjeblief hierdie jaarse 375, dit is die nieuwe Model 21 wat ons gaan weggeen, en uh, maak seker dat jylle jylle uh, donaties maak, en dat het kost 2 rand, ach, 200 rand om in te skryf, um, en uh, volgende jaar, ons het nou hierdie as een halve proefneming gedoen om al die structure en goeders in plek te kry, met die nieuwe winstgevende maatskapie en alles, nou volgende jaar wil ons twee van uh, jylle, daar so wat nou kyk, saam moet ons nooi, om bykie daai vlees in te kry vir die ouwe thuise en die kinderhuise, so onthou om jylle kaartjies te koop, contact vir Johan, asjeblief, um, hou aan om ons te ondersteun, miskien wen jy geweer, miskien kan jy hom nog sommer gebruik hierso, uh, saam met ons volgende jaar. Twee van jylle, twee gelukkige ouwens, of dame of so, uh, jylle kan dalk uh, saam met ons kom geskiet volgende jaar. Ek hoop so, so kry, kry jylle kaartjies gekoop ouwens. Een beetje bonte bokjes hier zo. Jij kijkt net vir hulle. Jy, jy tel nie, jy raak nie eens aan jou gebeur as jy na hulle kijk hier zo. En die vry staan. Nou, baie lekker woorsie hier zo. Maak ek een video nie. En, eh, uh, <laughs> A Ritger. <laughs> en Tini. En Marco. Jy sê lekker, ons het nou op twee springbokjes geskiet vandag. En, eh, uh, Daar sit ons vast. Ek moet net bij sê, dit is die driver en die ou van die plaas en die baas en alles. Hy, hy moet ken, maar ons sit vast. Ek persoonlijk denk is omdat het daar hy laks is. Daar is een strafdop. Daar is, daar is een Het kon, dit kon erger gewees het. Het kon een ranger gewees het wat vast sit. Yeah, I just wanted to finish off the video. We're back at home. Uh, now I'm one of those guys uh, in the car. I'm, luckily, I'm not driving around making the video. Not here. But uh, in any case, I um, just wanted to say to the Musgrave community, thank you very much uh, for supporting the initiative um, that we we uh, ran with Wildman George, the non-profit uh, leg of, of Wildman. And... Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'll keep you guys uh, updated uh, when we go and deliver the meat uh, to the various causes. Uh, working with Solidarity's Helping Hand. I hope you guys enjoyed some of the footage. I'm not a vi videographer, so I hope um, it was good enough to just give you a little bit of an idea. And then I want to encourage you guys, please go and um, donate to this cause remember uh, to buy your ticket it's 200 rand a ticket and that gives you uh, one uh, chance to to win the 375 h&h in the new model 21 musgrave um, and also uh, for next year uh, two of of the people watching now will be coming uh, with us to come and hunt and um, yeah we would just want to make the the community more involved and uh yeah this we don't have like the um how can i say the monopoly on this if you're a little far away or you you see a need in in your community where you are please um you're welcome to contact us to hear how we set up everything and how we 
uh, doing everything, the structures and, and the legal side uh, behind it. Um, we're, we're happy to give advice and if you want to then duplicate what we're doing in your area uh, where you are, uh, we want to encourage you to do so. So yeah, keep supporting uh, Musgrave and uh, Wildman uh, that has uh, created this opportunity uh, for our community. Um, and uh, yeah, keep making a difference wherever you are. And uh, hopefully uh, we'll, we'll see uh, the winners soon. So go buy those tickets uh, for the new Musgrave 21. Um, and yeah, um, thank you so much for uh, watching.